be. You can be. Anything. Anything. You want to be. You want to be. If it's to be. If it's to be. It's up to. It's up to. Me. Me. And thank you for that wonderful warm welcome. Do you have any ideas how did this man, Warren Buffett, oh. start in business? What do you think he did? Same thing as the tortoise. Same thing as the tortoise. It's a biography, yeah. What did the tortoise do to make money? Born. He saved. He saved. But what did he do to make money? What did the hare do to get money? Walk. He went to the bank. What did the hare do at the bank? He borrowed money. So what happens when you borrow something? You got to give it back. Now, what percentage of his money did the tortoise save? What? Ten percent. Ten percent. Now, if we get two, four, six, eight, ten, get you to stand up. Ten of you. Okay, come on. Up, 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 up. Yep. Stand up. Ten people stand up. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Who's going to stand up? We need one more. One more. Okay, this is a young man. Okay, we've got ten standing up. So we've got ten dollars. So how much of the ten dollars are we going to save? When we save ten percent of ten dollars, how many, how many of these people, these are all a dollar, how many are we going to save for ten percent? Okay, I'm going to get nine to sit down. So I'm going to ask this young lady to stand up with me. Stay here and everybody else sits down. Everybody else sits down. Now, how many did we save out of the ten? One. One. So what's ten percent of ten? One. One. What's ten percent of a hundred? One. Ten. Ten. What's ten percent of a thousand? A hundred? Did I hear a hundred? What's what's ten percent of ten? What's ten percent of a hundred? What's ten percent of a thousand? One hundred is right. Thank you for that. Thank you, thank you. Trader here. Trader here. Soon woke up. Soon woke up. With a start. As he remembered. As he remembered. He must repay. The bank, the bank before, before he could finish the race. But whilst he'd been asleep, the value of his investments had gone down, down, down. Trader here. Did not have, did not have enough, money enough money to pay back his loan. To pay back his loan. The bank, the bank made trader here, made trader here bankrupt, bankrupt. Just well, as he made a dash, just as he made a dash for the finish line. For the finish line. It is a four-letter word, four and it means a four-word sentence. Be prepared for trouble. Be prepared for trouble. Hi, I'm Kristen Smith. I teach here at Bellamy Elementary in Rome, New York. Tell me, Kristen, what, what did you think of today's session? I thought it was wonderful. It's always great for the kids to see authors and to see the, the thought process behind um, writing and reading. I also thought it was wonderful to have somebody from a different culture. Culture's a big thing in third grade, so to have, um, talk about where you were from and your accent. It was great to see them following along with you, with your accent, until they realized the words and what you were actually saying. It was fun to watch them make the connection between your accent with how they're used to hearing those words. And um, so what, what was the best part of the interactivity between the author and the children? Um, I would say 
having you reading the story and them repeating it with you, then you knew they were all listening and they were all on you know the same page. And um, again, the accent was just it was just a fun added part to the to the whole thing. Well, thank you so much. It's been great being here at Bellamy Elementary today. Great. Thank you for coming. Okay. Hi, my name is Nancy Opperman. I'm the principal at Bellamy Elementary School in Rome. It's a K-4 building. And today we had a presentation from Lucas. And one of the lessons that, and a connection that my students were able to make um, with the tortoise and the hare was that working hard and doing a great job will make you successful not only with money, but also with your schoolwork. And for our students, that's very important that they make what, that connection. What are the things you were to do with it now in the newsletter and the library and, and your resources? What I'm going to do is call our IT department and have them download the app onto our iPads. And the librarian came into the presentation and she is excited to put some of the lessons into her um, curriculum in the library. Well, fantastic. Look, I really appreciate being here today. Thank you so much, Nancy. Thank you. It was a pleasure.